What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Von Vlogs TV. Back at it again with another video. As you see by the title of the video, yeah, it's going down. And I just want to say thank you for everybody subscribed to me thus far and this for supporting the channel thus far. It's my first video of well, for your yeah, very first video. I've been uploading shorts because I've been getting a lot of traffic that way. So sorry guys that I haven't posted in a long time with actual actual video, but we're back. It's my first video. And a little nervous on this one, you guys, but I'm doing it for y'all. So if this goes well and <laughs> I can do it, you can do it. Cause it's my very first time doing it. But I'm gonna get to it, man. So as you see by the title of the video. Today we are going to be painting the calipers today. So we are going to be using G2 paint and lime green. So it may look funky with the stock wheels because it just regular all what you call it. But who knows? It might look good. We get right into it, you guys. So. Now, so I have a jack, so that's this right there, and I have the regular jack. So, what I'm going to do is I wish I had four jacks and jack stands, but I don't have any jack stands. I need to pick up something for sure. But I'm going to jack up one side of the car with this, just a little bit, and then jack up the other side with this. I already got the uh, e brake on, so, so the car won't roll. And that's the plan of attack right now. So I bet you guys once we're finished with that. All right, you guys, got the car jacked up. Got this one on this side. You want to make sure the car is, you just got to just up enough for the wheel, wheel to spin freely like you can see there. On each side. So after I take them off, I'm going to put them up under here like so, just in case the car drops. It'll drop on the wheels. Now I can still get up in there because I don't really care about those, but I don't want that to happen. Okay. All right, guys, now what we're gonna do is take the wheels off. All right, you guys, I got both of the wheels off. One wheel up under there. Here's the brake calipers. Always wanna inspect everything once the wheels are off. Make sure everything's cool. All right, let's show you guys. Freaking love having a big garage. Yep. Both off. Everything looks pretty good in here. So, what we're gonna do first is get to cleaning the brake caliper. So, let's unbox the G2 kit. And it is actually supposed to come with, yep, here it goes right there. Some brake cleaner. Let's go. Uh, I'm not sure if that's supposed to be that close. With this in my hand. Like I said, never done this before, so if I can do it, you guys can do it. So this is what this channel is all about. All this little foam and crap out of here. I'll clean my garage, man. Oh yeah. Get all these off. These so the paint don't mess up my my floor. Even though it's dirty right now, I'm cleaning it in the summertime, springtime, whatever. But you know. You want to keep the garage a little, at least presentable, at least, you know. But this is supposed to be the brushes, I believe, and the mixer. Yeah. Get the more of the little foam out. It's a small little can for them to paint all four. Jeez. Eight parts paint. Hmm. Still we ain't paint any of them. But, I'm not going to go that crazy, because it's got to do the rears. Mm. Oh, and it goes the reactor. So, watch a bunch of YouTube videos. We're going to pour this in here, and mix it up. And then, we'll be ready after we clean them. I think that's everything in here. Let's pour this out. Yep, that's it. Everything comes in. Here it goes right here also. All the components comes in there if you guys want to freeze it and see all the stuff that goes in here there you go but here you go some of the mini colors you freeze it nothing in the box all around all the colors the, the school numbers all that there you go 
All right, I'm gonna clump this mess, man. I hope nothing get in there. In the way. So what we're gonna do now? Probably should have sprayed that on here. Dang, that stuff is strong. Let's just clean up any debris because we don't want any of that in the paint. Let me go to paint. I actually need a light so I can see how far it goes back. I'm going to use the phone. And this one of them cleaned. Let's go to the other side, do the same thing. Definitely don't want to go up under there. Now that they're clean, clean enough. You just want to have to wash my hands after this. Oh, like I said, do not want to do that. Actually, since we're over here, I might as well start over here. Makes the most sense. In here, I hate painter's tape, those will stick really well. We're just masking off. Got this thing called. I know what it does though, just make sure to, I think it's a shim. I believe it's a shim, if I'm not mistaken. Just mask off the areas that we don't want paint on. We want to look as professional as possible. And then we're going to car shows, especially with those wheels. You better see all of this, so. It's a major key that all stuff gets protected. Mask off the dust boots. And people that know cars, don't know cars, dust boots are the little things that cover up the bolts so you can get, take the caliper off with. If you guys didn't know, that's not going to stick very well. Yep, like I, like I figured. And I've got to bring one of those little. Piece of cardboard over here too. Freaking hate painter's tape, bro. Nothing. Make sure you don't drive the car before this, because the rotors would be extremely hot after driving. Okay. That should be good enough for that side. Go to the other side, do the same thing. Uh, it is 10 and not trying to be out here all night, but Doing to look good I'm Going to need my Christmas tree puller, which is I think I lost that on one of my installs, but I, think I got another one in my book bag Pop the can up That green does look sick. <laughs> exactly the color I wanted. Should have a mixer in here. Sorry guys, a little bit nervous. We're gonna get through it, Joe. We're gonna get through it. Oh yeah, that is a nice one. Same bristles, but different color. Yeah. Dang, you're supposed to do eight. Four calipers? Can't be riding around with. Jeez, I hope so, man. But anyway, I'm gonna do. Let's pour the reactor in there. 
and get to going. Nice little stir. Oh, I'm nervous, you guys. Here it goes. What you need to get like paint remover? Remove all this. The first coat is not gonna be very thick, just to get the paint on there. Then the second layer is gonna be quick, thicker. But you guys see what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna hit you back after the first coat is finished. So, see you guys in a minute. All right, you guys, we got one side finished since the first coat. I actually surprised myself a little bit. Done pretty good. I gotta hit that right there. But on to the other side, you guys. Look, really impressed with the outcome. Move this out the way. It's gonna look sick. It's gonna look sick after it's finished, you guys. Let me see, I'm gonna let it dry. Put that on there. Drop a little bit. Oh dang, I gotta do that whole upper. You don't see that? Too fine. Yeah, dude. Oh, I missed this one too. What was I doing? Oh no. Okay, that's right actually. Because that back part is where the piston goes in and out. I don't wanna put anything there. With the second coat, you wanna go a little heavier. I feel like that one sit a little longer. I should might bring try to bring the heat over here just a little bit. We draw a little faster. This one been in front of the heat, so it's been drying faster than the other side. Let's try to bring it over here. Can I don't think it's gonna reach very far? Start on the second goat. Okay. Freak, hope I didn't get paint on my freaking GoPro. So I saw him up with you guys. I put a mask on. So. That's why. Second coat on this side. Now we're gonna move on to the other side and switch, bring the heat back over here. So all right, you guys, second coat is done on passenger side. Oh, I see a little something I wanna touch up real quick, let it dry. Come back for a minute and hit it again. For one last coat. Now we're gonna touch up everything else that you see. There it goes. Yeah. But let me guys know what you guys think so far. I think I'm crazy with the colorway. Well, I know it's gonna look funky right now, but you guys just trust me on this one. Trust me and wait and see it in the spring slash summertime. Once I can put the other wheels back on. Trust me on this one. Have I let you guys down thus far? All right, Vaughn Squad, we're finishing up. So, got everything finished, my bad. Uh, GoPro had died, camera died, freaking phone's about to die, I was using it for lighting. So, did not want to use it to record. However, this is the after product. Just right now, at night, finishing it up. But tomorrow we're gonna get it out in sunlight. Hopefully we got some sunlight. And show you guys out in the sun. Maybe clean it up a bit, cause you can see Michigan and weather winter wasn't nice to us. So, 
Yep, that's the front. Go. But it actually turned out very well. And see, I'm done a lot. Uh, you see what time it is, guys? Yeah, I know. I'm ready for it to be finished with this, but as guys can see, I know I got a little bit on the brake, whatever. On the dust shield and the brake, which can call it itself, but a lot of people just paint that. But I try to want to paint around it. I did one more coat, as you can see right there. But it's not bad. Very last coat on that. And just do touch ups and then put the wheel back on. And tighten all the wheels back down, torque them back down the spec, and finish. On to the other side. Just that one. All finished up. Oh, dang, I missed that completely, but oh well. I might touch it up tomorrow, I don't know yet. Or later. Mm, no, it's okay. Forget it. So I like taking the wheel back off. And the other front. So didn't actually turn out that bad. Actually guys, it wasn't hard to do. So catch you guys in the morning. Peace. What's up, you guys? It is the very next morning, and this is the next day how it looks. Okay, so one thing I did notice, I don't know if you guys can comment or not, but my freaking rotors are on backwards. This is supposed to be on that side, and that one's supposed to be on this side. Kind of pissed that I'm actually just noticing it. But it is what it is, guys. But I'm actually going to have a shop. Freak. Yep, so they do have to sit a little longer, <laughs> and plus it's cold out here, so yeah, you guys. All right, I'm gonna temper these stickers. I had to close the garage, but I wanted to open it so you guys can get the full look at them in the morning and how they look, whatever. All right, you guys, sorry about that. The freaking GoPro died in the middle of, middle of freaking filming, but like I was saying before, the GoPro died, where I just nowhere near a, a super great in detail wash, but. A little bit high soap and water in a bucket, nothing extravagant, extravagant because the brake calipers do still have to dry. I touched them and the top of them a little bit still wet. The reason why I have them on the wheels, you're usually supposed to just have a car sitting. But however, I didn't want to leave the car on jack stands at night. And plus, I only got two jacks. So, I only can jack up. And I don't have any jack stands either. So, I only can jack up the front and then the rear. I did them individually. But what we're about to do is pull it out in the sun, get a couple of pictures, and then put it back in the garage where it belongs. So, get right into it, you guys. Alright you guys, here's the finished result. Damn, wait a minute. <laughs> hey, they go crazy in daylight. No way. That's nasty. Yo, it turned out nasty. Let's go. Exactly the color I wanted. Something to give it some pop. Jeez. Hey, shout out to G2, bro. That lime green is nasty, bro. On me. Jeez. Like I said, this is nowhere near a big wash because, like I said, this is just for video purposes. Just to show you guys how it looks. Stand back a little bit. That's how it is in the shade. You know, saw it in the light. 
Jeez, like, I gotta get some couple flicks for the gram real quick. Hold on, y'all. Hold on one minute. Yo. One thing I did forget, let's get a montage real quick. Let's get a montage real quick. Hold on, y'all. guys thanks for watching another video and i'm overly excited and proud but man if you guys have any questions or anything you always know comment down below in the comment section you already know we're gonna get back to you about the whole process or whatever the prep or you have any questions about the g2 how to order all that i'm gonna probably put it in the uh link in the description below about everything we can get everything from but most of the stuff I had off hand, I had the painter's tape and all that stuff for projects around the house. Well, however, dog, that's nasty, bro. Just, y'all gotta subscribe. Y'all gotta subscribe and wait till the, the spring and summertime, y'all, because was them babies over there go on? Off them? Crazy, bro. And nothing else, we gotta get them taillights tinted to get a little, get that red out of here. And once the new decals come in, bro. The vision is coming together. The vision is coming together, bro. Now we need some more accents. Let's subscribe, bro. Wait to the other videos. Wait to the other videos, y'all. I'll tell y'all. We coming out with bangers, bro, for 2023, man. The whole plan is to do nothing but go up, man. And also, we right there. We're super, super close to a thousand subscribers, y'all. We had 840. I want to give a big shout out to all y'all. First liking and subscribing and everything. Y'all been going crazy for the boy. So, shout out to y'all, man. And who knows what's next. But anyway, y'all, thanks for watching another video of Bomb Vlogs TV. We out. And stay tuned for the next one. Wait, I almost forgot, man. Ha, I forget. That's the part of the saying. Don't ever forget. Don't ever I'm too excited, y'all. That's, that's the real issue. But don't ever forget. Trust God. Never lose faith because they never lose faith and trust in you. Yes.